In this video, I'm covering how to get and find your Discord token. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like as well. And please do make sure you watch this video right until the end of the full steps. And without any further ado, let's go and jump into this guide. Here we are on the Discord website, and the first thing to quickly note is you need to do this on a computer. Whether that be a Chromebook, a desktop computer, a laptop, it doesn't really matter. It can be any OS as well, as long as you can come and get to Discord.com. And the second thing to note is it's going to work best in this inner Chrome browser and that's how we're doing it in this guide. But I do recommend going and downloading Chrome, it doesn't take very long at all. And then once you're ready, all you want to do is go and click open Discord in your browser just here. And then two things are either going to happen, either it's going to go and log you in automatically and you're going to be on your Discord homepage or we just have to go and enter our email and password here. And here we are, you should now be logged onto Discord just like I am. Now just before we go and get into the next step, I just want to quickly note that the token can be very, very dangerous as it, people can use it to hack your account so be very careful with what you use it for and do try and keep it as private as possible and also a lot of scammers pretend to be discord mods or staff members to go and get your token but do not believe them be very very careful as i just said as a lot of scammers wanting this now all you want to do is come to the top right of your chrome and you want to go and click on these three dots here then all you want to do is go and click on more tools and then you want to go and locate developer tools just here alternatively you can go and press f12 or you can go and do Control shift and i so click here and it's going to go and launch this up here. Then what you want to do is go and click application. If you press F12, it's going to go and start elements, but make sure application is selected. And then all you want to do is come over to the left hand side and you want to go and locate local storage and go and press on the arrow. And then it's going to go and give us discord.com and you want to go and click on discord.com just like this. And then all you want to do is come to the filter and you want to go and simply go and search for token just like so. And now two things may happen. Either your token is going to be listed just here, as you can see, or you need to come up to the top left of this developer tools and go and click on the toggle device toolbar. And that's going to go and trigger it if it doesn't automatically come up when you go and search for token. And then all you want to do is go and press on token and you come down to this little um, text box here and you can go and fully select it just like so. And you can go and remove the speech symbols at either side as well. And you can go and right click on it and go and click copy. And then you can go and use your token for wherever you need it. And then once you're finished with the developer tools to go and close off it, all you need to do is go and press on the X. It's either going to be here or it's going to be up here as well. So go and click here and then it's going to go and close it. And now you're ready to go and use Discord just like usual. If you found this video useful, please go down below and consider subscribing to the channel. Leave a like for more. Peace.